Well, what I want to do is I want to be able to offer everybody a chance to be behind the scenes with me a little bit on what the paintings are about. Uh, every now and then there's just certain pieces and certain paintings where, you know, really want to give the background, why I painted it, how it came about, and also what it took to do it. So this, this, this piece today that we're going to highlight is Family Night. It was based on Lady and the Tramp. Uh, a commission piece I did for a really good buddy. Uh, he was really excited about it. We talked about it um, end of last year and just resonated with his heart. And there was, he's like, hey, I got a really high task. And I, I, this is something that I think would be really, really fun, but can it be done? So it resonated with me immediately. Number one, uh, the, the title came after, uh, you know, there was things that were, you know, thrown around such as family night, such as um, family style, things like that. However, it was just built on the basis that families get together once a week, have a big old spaghetti dinner and, you know, or pizza or whatever, but sit down, for us, it's sitting down every Friday night and getting dinner and watching a movie. Just popcorn, unplugged, being a tribe, hanging out and relaxing. And I know that that resonates with a lot of people. So that's why I wanted to film this video was to say, hey, I get that, we get it. We wanted to bring that together in a piece of art. So it was almost a four or five foot painting and the idea was to take every character from the movie and bring, well I should say, all the dogs and bring them together. Having a great family night, big spaghetti dinner, music, but then having the, the dogs from the pound also be a part of it where they're serenading and they're doing the music, you know, behind while they're having dinner. And so that was pretty much the premise. And then how does that come about in a natural looking setting? The challenge for me on this creatively was how do I take a scene that doesn't exist in the movie and actually make it feel as if it happened in the movie? And so um, the, the challenge then was, hey, let's first find all the characters. Now let's find them and bring them into a pose that actually works, that actually looks natural. Then light that whole scene and make it look as if it was, hey, wow, this whole thing actually existed. So it did take that classic scene did pull the guys, did take Tony, did take, you know, um, the whole idea of having them perch behind, being able to do the, do the uh, playing of, um, of the music behind them. But then, how can we have the dogs from the pound naturally sitting in the alley, hanging out, and it all just flow? So that was, for me, a really good challenge. And it took it up a notch, not only on time, but it took it up a notch on, on, on making it to where it didn't feel cookie cutter whatsoever. I'm really proud of it. I mean, I love it. Uh, it's one of my favorite paintings to date. And uh, it's something that I'm going to hang, probably hang in my own home because, <laughs> um, you know, that means a lot to us. This, this is a part of our life. This is a part of our family and this is a part of our legacy and something that I hope that will always continue even with our grandkids and especially people, you know, um, and collectors and guests in their homes. You know, that's a part of their life. It's a part of their memories of, hey, we used to do this as a family together and whether it's playing games or um, you know, sitting down and, you know, playing board games, checkers, whatever. And it's, you know, even though we're playing on the iPad, we're still playing checkers and still hanging out. But it's family nights, that whole idea of getting your tribe together and just having some good quality time and being able to look back at it. And now the kids, you know, they're, they're telling us, hey, Friday night, it's family night. And it's something that you can look forward to. So um, I hope you guys enjoy it and um, hope it resonates with you as much as it has me. And I've had a pleasure and an honor actually making it. So enjoy.